AI is an extremely powerful trend in crypto and Web2 right now, but there is one major problem. High-performance AI compute is heavily centralized. Imagine a world where it isn't controlled by tech giants, but shared globally, powered by anyone with a GPU. Our partners at Plank Network are building this as the first layer zero blockchain for AI and DPINs aimed at supporting decentralized AI networks. It tokenizes infrastructure to deliver global GPU access, enabling sovereign AI systems free from centralized giants, making compute affordable and open. With over $40 million in enterprise, great GPUs already deployed across global data centers, Plank powers real-world decentralized AI compute. And they're distributing both sectors, AI and DPIN, blending hardware, token incentives, and distributive computing to democratize access for devs and builders. And this is the new industry standard of decentralized AI. And it's super, super exciting. So let's go ahead and get into it. But first, thank you to Plank Network for partnering with The O Show, everything crypto every single day. Make sure to go down to the description, follow them on X, check out their website and join their awesome community and get involved in the conversation. Because again, AI is not going anywhere anytime soon. Again, thank you so much to Plank Network for partnering with The O Show. Now you guys go smash the like and subscribe if you're new around here. Plank's tech stack starts with Plank Zero. This is a foundational layer zero chain that coordinates compute security and cross-chain messaging, connecting to over 30 ecosystems like Ethereum, Polkadot, and BNB chain. Plank One, an EVM-compatible execution layer, optimizes AI workloads, letting devs run model training, interference, which is using AI models to make predictions, and so much more. Playing Zero DevNet is launching on 2025, well, late 2025, and Plank One Mainnet is launching soon after. So make sure to follow on socials for any announcements and updates. You don't want to miss this. Plank AI Studio makes model training, interference, and deployment simple, even for non-coders. And this is by offering low-code tools and API access to models like Llama 3. Plank Tunnel bridges assets and liquidity across ecosystems, integrating USDC payment rails for seamless compute billing. And I absolutely love that they've integrated crypto payments. This has Web3 written all over it. AI Cloud delivers instant access to high-end GPUs, cutting costs by about 90% compared to traditional cloud providers like Amazon's AWS. And this just isn't a vision. Plank has already generated over $1.4 million in revenue this year from GPU and compute services alone. Plank is building on all of this tier three force equivalent data centers and in partnership with Roman Group, a global investment network and investment advisory boutique. It's actively pursuing industry standard infrastructure certificates to support regulated and enterprise use cases. And here's what makes Plank's mission even more legit. It's backed by some of the biggest names in crypto and tech. These include Brock Pierce, yes, the co-founder of Tether, Microsoft, and even Google for startups. And Plank CEO, Dame has been vocal in interviews and AMAs about the focus on building real infrastructure for scalable AI adoption, not just hype. And that's important because Plank isn't just another GPU rental platform. It's positioning itself as a decentralized alternative to many of the centralized giants, especially as AI demand surges and chips remain in short supply. The Plank token launching October 2025 will drive the ecosystem powering compute orchestration, staking, governance, and access to features like developer grants and token-gated tools. GPU operators stake Plank to earn rewards based on proof of connectivity and proof of delivery, ensuring reliable contributions. Proof of connectivity means being online and ready. Proof of delivery means actual usage of the compute resources. When staking Plank, GPU operators receive L Plank, liquid tokens that can be delegated to co-staking pools tied to enterprise GPUs in data centers. And co-staking allows for anyone to earn from high-end GPUs without owning hardware. With enterprise GPUs, yield is between $2 and $3.50 per hour compared to $0.20 cents per hour from regular GPUs. And these aren't low-end cards either. We're talking about NVIDIA, H100s, H200s, and even B200s, the same chips powering cutting-edge AI labs. This co-staking model embodies the ethos of DPIN, where infrastructure ownership and rewards are open to anyone, not just the tech elite. And rewards come from token supply emissions, which are distributed monthly, and GPU rental profits sharing among co-stakers, creating a beautiful passive reward stream. 
L plank holders can also delegate to GPU nodes and vote in governance. They get to influence network decisions like compute allocation and network upgrades. And this is decentralization. With over 20,000 GPUs and thousands of CPUs, Plank is one of the largest AID pins out there, backed by 60 million invested in top tier data centers. On top of that, the GPU as a service market, they're tapping into projected to grow over eight times over the next decade. And Plank is ready, in my opinion, with over 120,000 unique wallets, 1.2 million transactions, and $62 million in TVL, showing strong adoption and community growth. Overall, Plank is setting a new standard for decentralized AI. It's a first layer zero built specifically for AI and DPEN, offering tokenized access to global GPU compute, real staking rewards, and advanced tools for devs. And with top tier infrastructure, major backers, and modular design that cuts costs and removes vendor lock-in, Plank is making AI faster, more affordable, and accessible for everyone. Whether you're a dev, staker, builder, this is the future of AI infrastructure, in my opinion. And again, you guys, remember to follow all the socials so you don't miss any announcements or updates. All the links will be below in the description. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, make sure you do your due diligence. Join the community and ask questions. Thank you.